Hi, welcome to Aether. This is the tutorial where I will show you how to pair and connect to your computer so that you can play any PC game you would like on your phone. First thing you're going to want to do is click on the rocket icon. And this page is the launch page where it's looking on your local network for computers it's able to join. Once you reach this page, you need to navigate to your host computer and ensure that first it is on the same network as your phone. This is nece necessary for the pairing process. On your computer, you're going to want to open up Google and search Sunshine Game Streaming. And it should be the very first link. Once you reach this page, you're going to want to scroll down and click on Downloads. After you click on Downloads, you should see the, mo the latest version and scroll down until you see Windows and it should, should say Sunshine Windows Installer.exe. Go ahead and click on that and go through the installation process. This is the software that allow us to make that connection. Click on More Info and Run Anyway. Click on Yes. Next, I agree, Next, Next, and Install. This is downloading all the assets and everything that is needed to go ahead and make this process work. This is some Sunshine documentation that you can use to learn more about the application, but this is not necessary. And go ahead and click Finish. Now you can close out of your, um, your Google tab. After you have done that process, you should see Sunshine right here. If you do not, you can go into your taskbar search window and type in Sunshine. Once you find that, go ahead and click on this and it's going to start up the instance. Um, and once you see registered Sunshine MDNS service, you can go ahead and go to your tab bar and find Sunshine. Click on it and click on Open Sunshine. Once you come here, click on Advanced and continue to localhost. This is where you need to type in a username and password for security purposes. Please note that you need to keep this username and password safe and secure somewhere because if you lose it, you won't be able to find them again and you won't be able to reach the Sunshine installation uh, or configuration page unless you uninstall the application and reinstall again. So once you do that, go ahead and click on Login. And it's going to redirect you. And type in that same password, username and password combo as before. And click on sign in. Once you have reached this page, you have successfully um, went through the entire process. So when you're here, click on this, uh, this burger icon to find the navigation drawer. Click on that and navigate to the pin icon. This is where you're going to pair your computer to your phone. Now, on your computer, on your phone, you're going to want to refresh the launch screen. And this can be done by going to the burger and then clicking on launch. Or by going back to layouts, clicking on the rocket again. Or to search. And give it a second and soon this should pop up. Once this has popped up, your computer and your computer name, click on the icon and then get that pin. My pin is 8956. You're going to want to take this four digit pin and paste it and, and type it in to your computer. So let's go ahead and do that. 8956. For everyone it's going to be different. And you're going to want to click on send. And just like that, I have made a connection. And now on your phone, I can click on desktop. And just like that, I am able to stream my computer onto my phone. And as you can see, a default layout has already been chosen for us. Let's try opening Minecraft. Perfect.
and I can click play. If you want to learn more about layouts, you can go to the layout screen or this, um, you can go back to the drawer, click on layouts and click on edit and then use this help icon right here. This will navigate you to another uh, tutorial video which will show you how to create your very own layouts and edit the layouts you already have. All right. So in the background, Minecraft is starting. So let's go ahead and go into Minecraft. And here we are. We're in Minecraft Java Edition on our phone. Let's go ahead and open up a world just to test everything is working properly. And as you can see here, it is. And I'm able to play my games on my phone. Awesome. And this works for any game, anywhere, after the installation process. I hope you enjoyed, and happy gaming.